when we consider the current circumstances and what are the migration trends in Armenia, of course, I always come back to this question, uh, was, uh, was everything okay with me that I decided to come back after Sweden, after Norway, after the US. Uh, US. But it was, uh, I guess, uh, it was a natural choice. I saw that there are so many cliches that are around Turkey which, um, which don't allow us to go deeper and to discover what is that country, what kind of transformation that country is going through. So the genocide and o other narratives sort of preoccupied the, the public discourse in Armenia. We're at the American University of Armenia in Yerevan where we just interviewed Varam Dermatevosyan who is a guest lecturer here. He's an expert and a specialist on Turkish studies. Varam spoke to us today about his life abroad, studying, getting his master's and PhD, returning back to Armenia where he's educating a new generation of scholars. Please stay tuned, watch Hidden People on Civil Net. <laughs>